Water tastes weird. Hmm. Probably should have cleaned the cup. Hello and welcome to attempt 11 of GTA 5 no damage run. I have a max HP of 1 so any damage kills me. I trip over, I die. A bullet hits me, I die. I have Trevor's power disabled, not only because it will make the game a little bit easy if I can make myself invulnerable to damage as Trevor can, but also because I want this to be a no hit run as well. And while having Trevor's ability on, I will be getting hit by bullets, which, you know, violates the, the no hit thing. Uh, subscribe to the channel. I've heard recently that that's an important thing you should ask people to do uh, if you're interested in this kind of stuff. I will eventually complete this because I have managed to do every single mission now without being hit or without taking damage. It's just a matter of doing it all in one go. So hopefully I'll do it this time. You never know. I'm going to be really careful with this one. Say my PB. Oh, my PB currently is 11 deaths, so 11 bits of damage, which isn't too bad for uh, 10 attempts thus far. Who's the imposter we're playing among us? <laughs> Michael's the imposter. <laughs> How do you know if you're ready when you're not ready and kind of ready and ready all at once? Okay, so we sit back very far so we don't get shot. Use these two as human shields. Kill people as they get out of the car. I, I killed him, right? He died. I should probably let them go a little bit further forward. So I have better vision, but... Where is he? Okay, I normally don't do it this badly. Okay, well, okay, that was really terrible. That was absolutely abysmal. And I blocked myself in here. This is awful. This is the worst I've ever done this. I deserve to die. I just created a barricade so I couldn't see this. Okay. It doesn't matter. It's prologue, right? Like, if I get hit, I can just immediately reset. It's all good. So about that being careful, Matt, you were, you were, so you were going to be uh, careful and uh, think about what you're doing. I will succeed this time, chat. I will. If before every mission, we are going to bring out like a whiteboard with markers and just like mark like our, our strategic game plan. Never been shot here. Let's not start it now. I can flip myself though. Okay. I meant to do that. <laughs> I've never seen such amazingly perfectly slow... How many rotations was that? What the fuck? Right. <laughs> I landed it too. <laughs> I've done prologue thousands of times. I'm still doing shit to surprise myself. Why is my power not working? Why is my power not working? Oh, right. It's been that long since I've played. I forgot where I put my power button. <laughs> Oh man, that's embarrassing. It's only been like a week, but then again, uh, you know, it is a new placement. That's really embarrassing. I'm sorry that you had to witness that. So mad about that, uh, definitely succeeding this time. <laughs> With a PB of 17, one death before the end of Trevor percent is worth resetting. My PB is not 17, my PB is 11. You call yourself a dark viper, you fan. You don't even know my PB for one hit. Well, what is this? That's a really nice stop. Okay, just take it easy, Matt. There should be no reason for you to die unless, of course, he hits you at the very beginning here. And when that happens, it's goddamn terrible. Okay, well, those just all hit the wall. That was not great. Oh, he, he moved. He normally sits there. I would prefer if he would go back to his spot. Thank you. I think... Oh. Didn't Lamar kill one? I just killed him by shooting him in the ass. So this is the guy we want Lamar to kill by himself. Can I take the time now to shoot this open? Yeah. Makes it easier to kill the guy when he spawns. Yes, okay, beautiful. Beautiful! I've never been shot by these guys, but it's always hard getting these shots. No one's... I, I looked at the fucking map. I hate myself. Ah! Got one at least. Up. Oh, oh, two. Okay. The nanosecond. The nanosecond. I looked at the map. They crossed over. 
Where's the guy with the bike? Oh, there he is. It's almost like I knew he was gonna be there. <laughs> We're no strangers to love, you know the rules, and so do I, full commitment's what I'm thinking of, you wouldn't get this from any other guy, I just wanna tell you how I'm feeling, gotta make you understand, never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, I'm sick of this song being in my brain. Not much happening here, at least for a while. The first part of this game is uh, understandably slow. It's not slow when you play casually, but slow in terms of uh, combat. Although I suppose I could die to Simeon here, but what are the odds of that? Like 10 trillion to 1? Mr. Simeon, don't kill me. Yes, stay down, old man. Is that a little dance spin there? Very weird. Oh, I broke the glass. Rip. You're such a fucking dictator. Such a fucking dictator. Emphasis on the dick. Pew, 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 pew. Once upon a time, you could kill that guy. Good times. How many deaths do I have in real life? Four. I think that's pretty good. Can someone ban Dark Souls 2 Mega Fan? Just ban him, dude. Ban them all! Throw them out the airlock! Look, guys, I'm gonna explain next level Among Us strats, okay? So, when you join the game, you know you're legit. So all you have to do is throw literally everyone else out the airlock, and then you win. In real life, think about it. If there's an imposter among, among us, then you would chuck everyone else out until there's no us. There's only me. Right, I forgot I don't have a car. Oh, no, 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 no. Ooh, okay. Isn't this great? I made a friend. How are you, friendo? I don't fuck mothers. Well, I'm not against it. I'm just, you know, I've not had the opportunity. This is my house. Feel free to make yourself at home. Again, I said I am not a motherfucker. You, you just want to hang out my car? It is a nice car. I'm going to watch TV. Wow, what a nice guy. Do I have a YouTube channel? I have THE YouTube channel. There is no other YouTube channels other than mine. Well, they may exist, but they don't really mean anything because mine is just so amazingly good. Uh, I didn't buy myself the SMG. Do I care to buy myself the SMG? It didn't really help me last time, but it really should, right? So I'm actually going to pay attention to this uh, bike right here, chat. Because I don't want to hit something and die. That may surprise you. My desire to avoid death. But, uh, you know, that's just me. It's who I am. Flashbacks to me dying hitting the bench because my dad called me on the phone. No! I still don't know if selecting the weapon first makes it so I use the weapon immediately when I'm on the jet ski. I don't think it does. Because I can just die getting shot in the scene transition here. Oh, beautiful! It'd be nice to see in the uh, replay, though, how close his first shots were to hitting me. I'm pretty sure he's meant to miss. Like, but then I know that he can kill me. It's always nerve-wracking. But that was some really fucking good shooting. Oh shit, he's really fast. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh crap. Oh! He- I, I thought I killed him! Oh my god! I swear to you! I swear to you I shot him in the face! Why were they so fast? Why were they there? Why did he not die? Why did they stop so quickly? Why did they get out that quickly? 
I deserve- No, I don't, because I definitely shot him in the face. I'm just impressed that I had the presence of mind to press my power button on my mouse. Okay. Need to grab all the money, chat. Show me the money! So we learnt last time that uh, I can actually die here. So we'll be using the alt strat just across this road. For those who don't know, the alt strat is when you hold down the character swap button and this makes it so the enemies have a much lower chance of shooting at all. I can die to melee hits. The game moves very slow. I can't fire or move my camera. And I can technically still die. It's as if Rockstar was like, okay, this person's trying to figure out who they want to switch to. We probably don't want the enemies to be shooting and killing them or something. So the enemy is just less likely to shoot. And of course the map gets completely fucked up. So it's more, it's an exploit of a kind, I guess. It's also kind of hard because you don't really know how fast you're moving and old strat is not something you want to use, but I probably have to use it like six times in the run. Still just the one here, right? Yeah. I've been killing this one guy. Look at that bullet there. That guy has never hit me. Maybe I should start hitting him. Or maybe I should start using alt strat there. Why is it not safer to go in the tunnels? That's a fair point, really. I'd have to test, because the reason why I still do the speedrun route is because there's less cops in this section. I don't know what's more likely, those cops at that tunnel hitting me, or the additional cops that would spawn killing me while I'm in the truck. I don't know, I know the answer to that question. Okay, it was very sketchy, but we did get through the beginning of the game without dying, which is a plus. So keep in mind guys, I am still skipping long stretch here. I'm doing it very, very late into the game so that I can have additional weapons when I do it. I'm going to Mr. Phillips now, which is uh, one of the harder missions that is really scary. So the first thing we're doing now is we're going to get a sniper rifle. We'll actually I'll be getting it twice. He's getting it once. He's getting it twice. Let's get to a Santa Claus joke. Gonna find out if the bike is a naughty or nice. <laughs> I'm lame. Do you even exist? I do, thankfully. No! I swear to you, that's just unfortunate timing. I mean, no one likes coyotes anyway. <clears throat> Thanks, dude. So I got the sniper rifle once, and I just gotta wait another minute for it to respawn again. So now I have my 20 sniper bullets. All I have to do now is not miss any shots, and therefore not die. <sighs> Deep breathing, gotta, gotta psych myself up for this. <sighs> I mean, calm myself down. I, I know what the fuck I'm doing, I'm breathing, okay? I'm, tr I'm trying to figure this shit out. I, I don't know, man, I'm just nervous. So I'm gonna be using alt strat here. Just so I can run to the very border of the area. You don't need to close the door, Trevor. I'm, I'm, dip, don't, okay, okay th thank you for closing the door. He's afraid someone's gonna steal his car or something. So I'll be moving to the very border of the map, to the extent where if I move backwards at all, I will immediately mission fail, because I'll leave the area. No one will be in range to shoot me, so I'll be able to snipe people as they run towards me. The only people who will shoot at me is people who are in vehicles. People in vehicles do not give two shits how far away you are. They will still take shots at you. Ideally, I will be behind this tree as much as possible. Step right up. Step right up. Oh, an Avenger fallen comrade. Beautiful. Okay, so I should be safe right now. No one else should come for me. Park myself as safely as I can here. Two bikers will spawn. Fuck. 
Well, I missed the shot. It's not great, but obviously, look, I, I had such good cover. Like, you know. There you go. Perfect. That was textbook, except that one missed shot. But that's what happens when you have very good strats, you know. Remember the days of, you know, eight, ten deaths or whatever on Mr. Phillips freaking out all those times? You know, you just gotta use your head. How many deaths do I think I'll have this run? I never know. I'm always running into new ways to die, new ways things can go wrong, you know. So we need to buy myself uh, some grenades. Granada! One of these days, they will hit my hand there, and I will yell very loud. Oh, shit, I'm dead. I'm dead. No! How did I miss all those shots? And then I winged him. Of all the missions, dude, this is... I And they're... they're Sucks. The thing's exploded, so I can't even blow them up with that. Look out on the left side. They gotta have the whole crew here. I am devastated right now. It's what happens when you think there's no way I can die here. Why am I even moving over that? What? I'm dead again. I'm dead again. Why couldn't I hit him? I don't. I don't understand. I'm gonna die again. I almost died. I almost got hit there. I just didn't take it seriously. Was my first death, first death bullshit? No, I played poorly. I deserve to die. You played the game poorly, you deserve death! Okay, sniper strats. I think after I've shot the first guy, then they come towards me faster. Before I shoot one guy, they don't really move as much. That's the first guy. What is concerned they're coming off to the left. Move a little bit closer, they should start moving. There's at least two more. Oh, there. Whoa. Like, where the fuck was he? There's still two more? Holy shit. What is going on? Oh! Okay. We never found a solution for this. This guy here can shoot me, and the guy who spawns there can shoot me. So we ignore the first guy. He could have killed me, he did not, thankfully. He shot two. Okay. Explode! Oh, thank fuck. Hopefully he died. With them all dead, it means that our ult strat here should be safe. Somewhat. I can still die here. There's like one guy with a gun on a bike. I'm turning right early as possible to put my tail in the direction of where he is. It still annoys me we haven't found a solution for those two guys at the beginning there who shoot. That guy shouldn't shoot. Can I just not hit this cactus, please? That, that's okay, well, that kind of, it's kind of fine. Should be okay, we should go a little bit further. Okay. 
I mean, doesn't make up for the death on the previous mission, but getting through this without dying is usually a good sign for the run. If you recall last time, terrible, terrible things happened when I went to get this tank. Now, I know that I should be able to get the tank on Crystal Maze. It's hard not to think it as not a coincidence, it's bad phrasing, that the time I died was when I went to get the tank on Crystal Maze. So what I'm gonna do, since I don't really care about how long it takes me, I'm just gonna use Cletus. Cletus never let me down. The one time I betrayed him, I died. So let's just, let's just use Cletus. For those who don't know, both the beginning of Crystal Maze and Cletus' side mission both have the function that you can't get the cops. So you can go get yourself a tank from the military base, which I use in a variety of missions throughout the rest of the run. The problem is, for some reason, uh, when you're stealing the tank, sometimes the military guys will aggro onto you for a second, and it only takes one bullet for you to die. And that's what happened last time, basically. Correlation does not equal causation. That is true, but correlation is consistent with causation and a necessary prerequisite for causation. And acting with the assumption of causation has no negative effect here. Let's not steal the tank from here. This this location scary and like like the even the tank will even run over the guys. Let's just not let's just not do this. I've stolen from them many times before without issue, but let's just not risk it. There's less people around here. Okay, just stop. Stop in the name of love before you break my heart. Did I say that Nervous Ron had the effect of not being able to get the cops? I'm in Crystal Maze. Shit. I'm going to save my game just in case. I probably should have saved my game while inside the tank, but like, nothing's gonna happen, guys. Nothing's gonna happen. It's fine. When has this game ever screwed me? Name one time! I rest my case. It's almost annoying how trivial this mission is. As long as I don't blow myself up, I easy win. Pew! You wanna see competition Pew. in the marketplace? Pew. Pew. To I've decided you. to get the guys on the top floor first, because I think they run down the stairs and get stuck in places. How is he not dying? Die! I get him? I wonder if it's possible to drag the people from outside, uh, from inside outside by like moving further away. Because you gotta assume a lot of these guys are just taking cover from me. I did it again! The shot bounces back, dude. There's something about glass that reflects the shots. Oh, God! I am not gonna hit this glass. I'm not. I'm Okay. Let's not do that again. Look, it's bouncing off. It's so dumb. Did I get him? Think I got them both? I'll do one loop. Just to see. And to give the tire the fire time to uh dissipate. A new record! Get it? It's like going around the house was uh you know, a race thing. Ah About that fire dissipating. I'm just gonna go outside. Wow, he is really burnt. Holy shit. This is like some Dark Souls 1 stuff. He crispy. Let that be a lesson to you, chat. If your house is on fire, just leave and come back. It'll, it'll go away. And at long last, pew. You disrespectful pricks. And away we go. Will go away the fire of the house? Yes. Hello, Lyle Lazy. I did not want the cops. 
Give me a hundred percent solid with you here. Did not want that to occur. I could just enter the mission to lose the cops, but I kind of prefer dropping off the tank before the mission. Bye, tank. I'll come back for you later. Sneaky, sneaky. I'm always worried about stumbling here. It's never happened, but this is a Rockstar game. Is there like a smoother place to get up than this? Now that I've said that, I'm really scared about doing it. Why do I always fail this last one? Where's my car? Where's your car, dude? But well, how many people have actually seen that movie now? Easy. Ouch. Freedom. There's no reason to this jump. Oh my god, if I die, I'll be really pissed. Okay, we're fine. This is the place, I think it is at least. Floyd. Floyd. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Not sure what that could be though. Well, I guess I'll save the game, but... Davey! How you doing? Davey! How you doing? So, I think I've died here the last couple of times. The gun just fired on the ground. Next guy, I don't think spawns until I move up. This is the hard guy because he's behind the counter. I'm tempted to try getting him as he pops up sometimes. Rather than waiting for him to run around and he's bloody like he's stuck in the corner, he's coming. We got a little bit of power left. So this guy after the right spawns. Does he not feel like spawning today? Oh, there he is. Oh, you're right near the door. Come on, man. You're a shithead. This is fucked. It is. I'm trying to step behind cover and stuff whenever I kill someone just to reduce the chance of me getting hit by a random bullet. We got the exit. Hey look, a bucket and a mop. You probably need that for a lot of things. For this wet ass fewer. Okay, so this guy off to the right is dangerous and I don't have much power. Shit. Should be fine. Okay, I ran out of power there. That was not that was not good. Okay, now for the scary part. Am I gonna die? So getting in these cars is a non-starter, because I can immediately be shot. But running away is also scary because the helicopter can spawn in a very disadvantageous place. This is bugs that radius of our site there. Okay, I've just barely outrun this helicopter site. It should not be able to see me. The game cheats sometimes. You watch my stamina too. Nice. Okay. <sighs> Very satisfying for that to go well. Always a scary mission. I fucking love that song, dude. Give me everything you've got for this wet ass P word. You need a bucket and a mop for this wet ass P word. 
<laughs> I'll do yoga just because it's stress free. I'm not mentally prepared for three's company right now. <laughs> when are we going to get a McMato McDonald's burger? Either when I save the CEO's life or kidnap his family. Ah, no! That would have been a terrible way to die in this run. I So much for yoga not being stressful. Ah, I can't believe that much has happened. This is a very serious mission now, guys, because of Franklin potentially getting killed when I shoot down the helicopter. Ideally, what happens is I either shoot the helicopter when it's so far away that the other guys in the helicopter won't shoot at me, or when I shoot the pilots, the guys on the sides catch on fire, which often happens. Who the fuck is you? I gotta remember to reload. I didn't reload. Hey, why are we just hanging here? There's guys shooting at you, Mikey. That's unfinished business. Clean it up. We'll move on. You damn softy. That's it. Get us out of here. What? But the game isn't frozen. He's still. But that it's but the game isn't frozen. He's his it's still flapping and the thing flapping still down there. I've never seen the like. What is this? Does any input work? Yeah, I can pause. I can't switch character. Uh, I've never heard of this happening before. Well, I guess we're gonna load the autosave. It says soft lock for killing them too quickly or something. That is the first time I ever used Michael's power to kill the first two guys. I can only assume that that is something the game does not want you to do. What's that? You played the game in a way that we didn't expect? How dare you, sir? I forgot the heist money? I feel like I'm forgetting something. True. Let's try again. Please, please. You got a bogey coming at you, Franklin. Yes. I miss his ass. Hey, it's up to down, Hulk. Nice one, kid. One shot, one kill. I think that was too far away from the fire. These guys shouldn't shoot at me. I was able to get them really quick. Hey, Woo! Once upon a time, this mission I thought was so free, right? <laughs> now I have to worry about it. it. It sucks, but it's very satisfying when I don't die on it now. Everyone's favorite scouting the port. But the only way I can die is if I'm stupid. So I can die, basically. Drop. What? Ah. Uh, hello? That's... I've never seen that before in my life. Whatever you reckon, game. Whatever you reckon. What's the graphics card? It's the card of graphs. Like, you know, in the business world, people put a lot of stock in how good your graphs are. As so you walk around with a, a, a graphics card, it's basically a card that shows off how good your graphs are. So that thing from um, Nickelback, right. look at this graph! You know, that old meme? You okay? All you okay? All right. So Franklin doesn't have his money right now, but if I just sit on Franklin enough, he'll get the money, so it's fine. One thing I definitely want to do is not forget to restock at various different parts. What can the best mechanic in LS do for you? Wow, brag more. Let us go now to the long stretch and not die. That's the plan.
a long stretch. It's not free by any stretch of the imagination, but it's nowhere near as hard as it used to be. Did I say Hood Safari? I meant long stretch. What did, what did I say? God damn it. Okay. So first room, as always, they can beat it themselves, but it takes them forever, so I try to help where I can. Nice. No one got stuck. So the guys can pop through this door and kill me, so I need to take cover immediately. And spray. Okay. So start with an assault rifle. Why isn't he moved up forward? Uh, I had no idea you could only trigger one of them. It's not good. Go through! Oh, that's, that was terrible. I'm even scared to uh, move back here now. Did not know that was possible. There's no reason to use a sniper here. Apparently they're having trouble with one last guy. Oh! If I had a sniper rifle right now, he would have died. Did not expect him to pop out there. See what's up ahead, homie. There you go. Man, I deserve to get booked. You know who you fucking with? You ain't creeping on us. Now these guys I can get immediately. I didn't get them all, that sucks. This Chamberlain gangster family's here. Lamar and Stretch can get the rest though. And now for the hard part. So I can get one person in the top corner here. It never seems to give me the flash though. There, Okay, well I got the flash that time. And now I just have to hope they can do it. The only problem is if Stretch or Lamar die, which is not common. Uh, it doesn't look like they're doing good. We got one. Lamar's moving up. I should be in a position where I can move. I'm better off moving before they kill literally everyone in the next guy's spawn. Ah, they spawned. Then let's see if I kill myself with grenades. And you got one. They're moving up. I'll risk it. I'll uh, hope they don't die. Kill him. Yes. I could totally get them in that corner with just a nice place grenade. The mask not being helpful. He's running up. Get him. Oh, this is terrible. I regret my decisions. Okay, that's one more. Okay. Kill him! Kill him! Ah, oh, crap. Okay. Surely he died. Okay. One more. I don't normally leave them to do this much themselves. Yes, kill him. Okay. Now, I think there should be no more guys. Yeah, I thought there might be one more. Okay, uh... My explosion was not far enough to the right to kill that guy. So he learns... Can take these guys out without blowing open the door. Okay. Did I not get it? Come on! Mm, okay. Can't even see. Okay. I'm surprised these two didn't move. These guys don't shoot, so are not a concern. But that they aren't up the ladder yet already is concerning. So I might not take the ladder here. Okay. Now I'm going to get my car. So should be fine here. Hurry up. We got to go. go. A beer would be good for that kid. Come on. Come on. We got to drop this heat. Keep them rollers off us.
Oh, who's shooting me? Oh, the helicopter? Fuck, dude. In the odds of those bullets hitting me were like astronomical, but it's obviously not something I want to deal with. Okay, easy. Now for long, no, hood safari. Yeah, I got that right, right? Uh, just a little bit more scary. So I'm using ult immediately here because there's like a 1 in 10 trillion chance I can be shot immediately. So for those who haven't seen this mission before, the main risk is just Trevor dying. I help not because I really need to. Trevor and Lamar technically can kill everyone. It's just a matter of Trevor dying. I have to continuously watch the map to make sure the people aren't running around to me either. Blowing up that car and not killing anyone is not a great move. Okay, got the guy that makes Trevor flash red. This is going pretty well. Lamar's actually moving up quickly, which is not something he normally does. They're in the thick of it now. Trevor's actually about to die. These guys are spawning a lot faster than normal. Are they coming to me? Uh, this is not looking good. Hold on, Trevor. Get anyone there? Okay, he was aiming at me, which is not good. It's three more. Four more. It's not gonna go. Okay, five more. That's. We got one. Oh, yeah, she shot at me there. It's not good. They're aiming at me. Oh, Ha! <laughs> Trevor died. I, why were there so many more guys? I swear to you, there's not that usually that many. At least it isn't a fail. But whenever I respawn here, there's a chance I can die. Like normally, Lamar hangs back. He was very in the thick of it there, which is good and bad. I guess maybe most people spawn when he's in the thick of it. Trevor, see how far Trevor has run up, just in the thick of everyone. Look at him. He's on the. He's in the. See him there? He's on the other side of the map. Am I doing this too well? Am I doing this too well? Like I'm so efficient at taking people down now. Trevor's moving up too quickly. Suffering from success, perhaps. This I need to help with, though. I think. Because killing that guy. That flashing red has nothing to do with Trevor's HP. I think me killing that guy is what triggers Trevor to move up. And I'm triggering him to move up too early before everyone's dead. And so he moves up while there's still 57 people on the map and gets destroyed. That's my theory right now. Or I'm directly hitting him with grenades. So Trevor's stuck here because this person on the other side of the house here, they're still alive. So Trevor's gonna stay. So he's going to keep flashing until that person on the other side of this wall is dead. My concern is that he's taking extra damage that I'm not seeing. Usually I do end up killing it though. I think I've waited long enough. This guy being here, the Tre and Trevor not killing him is concerning. So he's just doing damage into his back. I should have got rid of him first. He's behind Trevor. I, ha I have to somehow deal with him. This is very scary. <sighs> Trevor isn't red yet. It also might be a matter of me moving too far ahead. 
If I move too far ahead, more guys spawn and they get overwhelmed. I oh, don't know, no, Trevor's about to die. Well, there goes that idea. Ah, uh, now I've moved them up. And they didn't kill everyone. Ah, oh, they got two more, okay. Crap. <sighs> so it should be everyone. Okay. So that Yeah, this calls me losing, that's fine. That's fine. And uh Surely that will get him. Surely. Is there any advantage to switching to Trevor here? I don't think so. I should have got the AP pistol. It's more accurate than the SMG. So we're gonna hang back here so this car can't hit me. And hopefully the cops. Okay, got it. Okay, okay. I hear gunfire. The cops saw me. Surely they won't shoot me though. Now this is the hard part. I still don't know where I want to shoot on this. Baby, look, you're not even my type. Oh, oh. That was someone. That's why I don't date younger women. Stress sets you up, nigga. Your big homie a snake. At least you got to meet MC Clip. Jack that motherfucker. Was that who that was? Little brush with another celebrity. Okay, that oh that was that was surprisingly effective, okay. Either that's because I got the pilot initially, or I actually got the tail there. It, it didn't look like I got the tail, but I've never been shot by the police on the sides here. But we could start now. <gasps> okay. That helicopter spawn, please, no. Let's see, why is there waves? And I remember, I'm not on 1.27. Normally, you'd be Trevor at the end here in the speed run, so you could do mini sub immediately, but you know, for my purposes, I don't care about speed. Yes! Oh my god, it's so ah, that's, I was so nerve-wracking the entire way through. You've no idea. We are doing really well. This is this is the best pace ever. Like, not even close. So Mayweather Heist, the only concern is with Franklin when Michael's already in the boat, I need to take out all the snipers really quickly. If I don't, they can get out and, uh, and and shoot and kill me. So it's important that I miss no shots at that particular point. It doesn't matter because your job is not to understand. It's to shoot at people who try to stop us. No! That is fucking devastating! That's better. So you just spin. It's a bit easier. Dang it, dude. Dang it, man. At least that death is easily avoidable in the next run. Biz, those deaths are not deaths that I learn anything from. They're completely pointless deaths. That death was only caused by me not paying attention to the fullest for that particular nanosecond. You know? You're right. For the next updinth runs, I'll focus on that. I'll remember it next time, and I'll be sure to uh, not do it. But you can guarantee there's something like that that happened in the fourth or fifth run that I've completely forgotten about, and could equally happen in the future runs as well. You can't be perfectly diligent at every second. Uh, oh, oh, you. I had no idea that they could shoot me. That's concerning. Okay, wait, wait. I, did I reload with Franklin? I did not. I'm just going to let Michael move in himself. I don't think I changed anything, but. I could probably throw proximity mines with Michael. Yeah. We got to test that later. This car is further along than it normally is. I don't know why. Only have three bullets. 
I'm just going to let them go. Uh oh. Okay. Ah, you, that was perfectly on target. I have not had that take that long in a long time. That was really scary. None of these guys have ever shot and killed me, but they do shoot at me. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh. Oh, oh I, I've, I've, I've never missed this many times. I don't have enough bullets. Who's like? Ah, uh, I'm gonna reload here. Oh my god! What is wrong with me? I've. Runs good so far, IMO? Yes, it is still amazing pace, but the way that I died is just so pathetic. So we're on Blitz play. Always scary, but I've done it many times without dying. So I killed myself once here by putting the C4 in the wrong spot. So I am not going to do the C4 strats here from speedrunning. I'm just going to run all the way over here, a million miles away from the C4, and throw it from here. There we go. Uh, I said I didn't want to use proximity mines, didn't I? Okay, got it that time. Did it get the other one? Oh, no, that's bad. I'm dead. 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 Okay, I'm not dead. The one shot. I'm nowhere near that ladder. I hate this game. That's the movement you're meant to do. Well. I can't believe I died. Can't believe it. I'm so devastated. Got one. Got it. I've done this so smoothly. That was the fastest I've ever done that. It was so smooth and clean the entire way through. That is legit painful. My strats there are so good. And one frame of not paying attention to this fucking terrible game and I died. One shot that they made at me. One fucking shot. Yeah, I'm glad I already had two deaths as well, and this wasn't a perfect run, but at the same time, I would like to PB. I would rather die from the game being bullshit and me getting shot from a million miles away than me making a mistake or being sloppy, which is what the last two deaths were. Cab, hey! Cab. Hey. Hey is what horses eat. <laughs> There's no reason to shoot this guy, but I'm going to do it anyway, because fuck that guy. Okay, 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 okay. It's important. Kick him over. Okay. Easy. Like, you should never lose this fight. But I have died here before, so I'm always nervous whenever it occurs. Die, Rocco. Oh, 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 okay. How do I get most of my money? 
On weekends, I wear a mask and I have a gun and I go into buildings and they give it to me. It's it's an amazing scheme. I don't know why people don't do it, but it works for me. You know, it can work to work for you. <laughs> okay, so we're still doing the alt strat here. I imagine I I can't imagine ever doing this without it. I think I could succeed in some rare cases without using the alt strat here, but I'm, it's just not worth the risk. Hello, everyone. I'm taking this. I guess if I ever wanted to do this without the alt strat, what I would probably do is uh, get to some high point and snipe and try to kill all of the guards. I wonder if the police would come. They probably would. Hmm. He always gets wrecked. That is his fate. Groundhog Day, getting hit with a car every time. That guy too. Sucks to be him. I'm always nervous about the shootout at the end here. Because these guys are in cars, they are perfectly willing to shoot from 10 billion miles away and try and hit me. And I've got this little glass window in the back of my car, which I really wish didn't exist because they can definitely shoot through that and hit me. I use my uh, Franklin special ability to make it so I can aim uh, a lot better, but they can still shoot during that. Top five bourbons, the five cheapest ones at whatever place you are. <laughs> There's nothing here that I'm about to hear. Okay, I think I just ran into something. Okay. Oh, that's a pole. That is a pole. I have to break the window. Shit. Fire. Okay, we have to start breaking these windows early. Over, Get off the I already pulled Get over. The fuck out of here. Jump. You jump on the green there to avoid a small slowdown. I still remember the speed one strats. Ah, uh, this is not looking good. Plane should be further along. Please. Okay. They look very sketchy for a second there. That was perfect. He fired no rockets. In the speed run, that would have been very good. Oh. He better die. He died again. These guys can still hit my hands, you know. So I don't want to jump up too often. You watch, I'm gonna get crushed by one of the cars when I run up. It's guaranteed. He didn't die? Are you kidding? You kidding? You kidding? Okay. Okay. One of these days that plane is gonna bounce weirdly and kill me. So someone actually said that this guy up here can kill you. He can shoot and kill you. I don't... I don't think I... It's never happened to me. I'm not going to take the risk. Get off my Have we got a pilot on board? It's possible that he can shoot his gun as he falls. But I'm more concerned that I'm going to shoot an explosion up there and it's going to hit me or bounce back down. One day maybe that pilot will kill me and then I'll do something about it. But until then, I'm not going to worry about it. Well, that sucks for that deer. Hey, look, it's my tank. It would be a shame if I used it to uh, steal some military hardware. Crush. Oh, what the fuck? You're kidding. I, I was midway saying crush. Because I was just going to crush the things, but apparently that's uh, a very strong box. This week on the Lark Peaking Lawyer, we're going to break into this filing cabinet. Uh, I'm not going to bother firing. Uh, I'm worried about hitting the actual thing. And I have all the time in the world, so. Yeah, we can get that. There we go. Wait. Did I actually hit the thing? For a second there, I thought the, the other thing was on fire. It's not there. Okay. 
It's a very bad spot for that to have uh, arc. <laughs> that to have uh, ended up. Okay, just... Guys, just fuck off. Ah, stay. There's a tank and things on fire. Don't just drive off. We did it, guys. You and me, together, with the military hardware, dearly. So I died five times last time here. Was it four? A perfect mission here would do a lot for beating my last PB. Okay, focus. This can be done. We've done it before. A little bit of luck involved, though. A little bit of luck. Okay, you're gonna use C4 here. I still don't even know if skipping matters here, but it's actually difficult making this weapon swap and then exploding and then doing all this immediately. <laughs> Look at the two guys flying through the air. So I can still die here, but if I die here, it's just entirely random. There's nothing more that I can do here to increase my likelihood of surviving. It's happened twice though now. I'm saying that I've gotten shot while using ult strat twice here before. Can you stop please? You're kidding. This is the furthest I've ever seen this car go. Are you for real? Can you stop? Are you... It's not stopping. Uh, that is not normal. Do myself a little dance there. I'm actually sweating bullets right now, chat. It doesn't normally take this long to get here. Okay, there's, there's no one coming around the corner, so should be good. The guy- oh, oh my god, he actually shot at me. Holy shit. I was about to say that guy's never been fast enough to shoot at me. Got him, okay. So now I have to switch to Michael when I think he's safe. This guy always respawns. So there's no point in me killing him. So we have someone again. It's very dumb, I don't know why. Okay, just wasting bullets. Hopefully Michael's safe. I don't think he kills these guys. I think it's better that I do ult strat here. Uh, I really should stop leaving Trevor with an explosive weapon. What if he kills me? Oh my god, please Trevor, stop shooting. Can you just use a normal weapon just for a second, Trevor? Just don't, just don't kill me. Oh my god, he's still using it. Um, you, you, you're scary. They get this fence themselves, but I may as well get it for them. Um, where's Michael? I've never seen him be there before in my life. I didn't get grenades. Remember? I meant to get grenades for this. It's not super important, though. I got him, but he respawned? Why'd he respawn? He just respawns whenever I stop looking. I might have to move Michael over here. But who's Michael shooting at? Oh, that's not Michael. Ah, this game's bugs completely. I have no way of fixing this. Short of mission failing. He must be going for the guy that's around the corner here. I'm hoping... That because I triggered that next section, that this guy won't keep respawning. It's my only hope. If I can get him again. Oh shit, there he is. Oh crap. How is this guy not dead? You're kidding. Oh my god. You're kidding me, dude. If I die here, 
to this bug. Are you insane? You are insane! Oh my god! Is it worth killing my ally? Is it worth killing my ally? Can Michael do this all himself? What is Michael even doing? What is Michael even doing? There's no car there. There's no car there for him to sit at, so he's confused. I have no idea where I will respawn. This entire thing is so bugged. Can I kill my friend? I can't even remember. There's a scene where he can't die and it might be this one. Okay. Gonna hold on old here and we hope we're in a good spot here. Ah. Uh, this is probably the best scenario as long as I don't get shot here. What was any of that? I just gonna switch to Michael. I've never been in a situation where I've died and had to respawn there. So if these guys act differently, I have no way of knowing. I'm pretty sure they kill the fence themselves. Uh, okay, then maybe they don't. I know they kill the second fence themselves. It just runs through the fence. Michael, you are special. You special little guy. Those walls are, man, they... You're getting them good. There's a guy over here. What the fuck is that guy over there for? There's a guy down there. There's a normally guy down there. That's concerning. So you're going to run forward here to spawn the rest of these guys. Uh, it's usually not very far forward. Need to hope I do not get shot. Just watching the map to see when they spawn. Usually a little bit forward. There they are. That guy who was back where we came from is concerning. He's not normally there and I'm worried he's going to do something that I'm not used to. He's no longer there, that's good. This guy's still here but we can kill him. Okay. So should be able to do nothing at this point, just wait, just wait. So while I normally like to have grenades for the next scene, it's unnecessary. I really only need like just a couple of explosives and then I can snipe everyone through a small crack. My gun got shot? If the thing came up on the side, they shot my gun if I didn't die. It seems to happen every episode, though. I always get comments in the section like, It looks like you got shot. I'm like, that. Nah, that's my gun. Got very lucky, then. I deserve some luck, though, after that first fucking scene. Probably a risk I didn't need to take there. You see, yeah, I can see him. I don't know if they can even kill these final guys. What usually ends up happening is one of the cars explodes. I should be safe to kill them. I should be safe. 99.9% .9 of the time. But remember that one time where they shot me? Remember that time? See that bullet that just flew through there? What I want to do is just snap that guy in the corner. But I know if I just wait, be patient, we'll progress. One speedrunning ramble later. Sure, then maybe you can run around by yourself. Okay, well, we'll end that conversation because apparently we finally progressed. <laughs> it's gonna be look very weird in the edit. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, so let's move on. So all I'm doing here is moving off to the right, throwing some C4 to kill the cars that come up, and then sniping a bunch of guys. You usually use C4 here, but uh, I'll just I use grenades here, but I don't have any. Okay. Like, I've never been shot through here, but there's always a first for everything, right? These guys infinitely spawn up here, so I'll always have targets. And if you kill enough, eventually you progress. I respect your service, but can you we good? Fuck off? That was a lot fewer than I expected. I'm always panicking here to switch as fast as possible, but I don't really need to because I'm a million miles away. So, of course, the same little route here as always, so the enemies don't spawn. It's kind of a pain in the ass to get through here, though. Die, fences. Disrespect your surroundings! Dead it, dead it, dead it, dead it. So, we kill this guy here. And, uh, this guy here is always a hassle. Because for some reason it won't shoot over. There we go. We're doing well, chat. Got some bad luck, some good luck, but we're doing well. Now watch as the game bugs and I get hit by this tank. It's 
Basically guaranteed. Oh my god, that was close. So I did not get more ammo here, which is uh, going to cause me issues. Shot was very close to me. Get him, chickens. There's always this one last guy. He doesn't like to come through. He is on the other side. So we'll do what you always do. What I've been doing. It's funny that the old strat isn't making noise now. It's quite nice. So doing it this way and having these extra guys spawn makes it harder for me to beat this next room. But it's the only way to get this guy reliably. Because my friends can't kill everyone in this next room. There he is. And you got two of them. The other guy would be in the back corner. Scary. Please. <sighs> so, you guys remember when I got hit through this glass? I still have to do it this way, though. I have no choice. I just have to be better. That's not good. That's bad. That's bad. Ah, oh, crap. I'm scared. Oh, oh my god, I'm... Failing. It's looking very bad. Please tell me that hit him. Don't know how that guy got stuck there. Oh, come on! Can I really not get an angle through this glass? Jesus Christ. There's something about this door that makes the spray worse. Yes! Finally! The rest of these guys they can kill. I mean, the, ne the, the next guy here. Usually they kill him immediately, this is concerning. Finally. So... This first guy is the only guy who's free. Well, not even free, but it's... It's not this one, it's the one further left, which is the harder one to hit. I can't get it to spawn while being here. Oh, come- No! He sprinted to the right, lost me my cover of his body, and he fires one bullet perfectly through there. And my bullet hits the- hits the fucking yellow. Unbelievable, dude. UNBELIEVABLE! <sighs> okay, so we'll just spawn them in and I won't challenge this guy, which is... ...concerning in of itself. So, I wish we challenged him. It's just so dumb. I, wait, I, wait, I looked on the map and I was waiting for him to duck back in so I could shoot him. So the rest of this is grenades. And uh, all of these grenade throws are risky. Michael's permanently shooting and maybe he'll stay down. And then he ducked back up. You're kidding. I had to hope he was stunned there, he wasn't. These guys shouldn't be able to shoot me. That one death, dude, for the frame. Ah, oh, we're on such good pace still, but ah, uh, it. Uh, we've just reached the point where every single death feels so cheated. Like, still my fault, I guess, because I did miss that shot. You know, if I got that shot, I would have lived. You can't help but blame yourself. You know, it's it's like it's it's a hard shot. I just didn't expect Michael to move. You can do this. You can do this. Uh, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm legit frightened. Oh. Oh. Okay. It's definitely on there. Did not want to go underwater, unfortunately. The controls for water are terrible. Oh my god! I'll never understand why Rockstar thought having a dive button made sense. 
when they just put you under water regardless whether you press dive or not. Am I aim aiming badly here? Am I crazy? Do not dive me underwater! It's right there. I have no idea how I'm missing. There we go. Okay. No! <sighs> Nothing I could have done. I, I didn't do anything wrong there. First bullet. First bullet. Angled. From a helicopter. 50 feet in the air. It's possible that I was just too close to the wall. And what I really want is a better angle to shoot them earlier. I believe I got that first try. Yeah. That was probably it. Oh, that's the guy I should have killed first. Oh, crap. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. The second that I shot the pilot and he didn't die, I'm like, this helicopter's not gonna catch on fire and that guy's gonna fucking shoot me and he did. I fucking, I fucking hate this game. There is no reason, no way that a person who, whose helicopter is flying and just spurning out of fucking control can shoot a bullet perfectly from that fucking distance. It's one bullet! Makes no sense! There's like a 50-50 chance that the helicopter catches on fire when you kill the pilot. And especially with two bullets, there's no reason the helicopter shouldn't have caught on fire. There's not, there's not more that I can do there. I play perfectly. I can't do more than shoot the pilot perfectly twice. You can't kill the, the weapons guys first because there's two of them. I'm dead. So I just learned that you can't use alt strat while aiming down the side of your weapon. I did not know that. The distance for this helicopter is a lot further. But I might have to minigun it. It's just so... It's, it's much less safe. May as well give it a go if the game is just going to be shitly programmed today. Up. Bro, I'm gonna run out of bullets at this rate. Come on. I was perfectly shooting him with a hundred percent accuracy and he didn't die. This is some insanely bad RNG, dude. This this is just fucking insane. You try so hard and you play so perfectly in the game, it's just like mm, bullets damage. Uh, what does that even mean, really? Come on now. What don't players love when their bullets do no damage? I thought, uh, yeah, I think they do. Let's just add that randomly all the fucking time, man. Mary, when the recovery teams arrive. I'm looking. I'm looking. I survived there because he missed. No more sniper, so you can come out as soon as you find something. Yeah, as you can see, that's not better. Took just as long to kill him, they just didn't shoot me. It's possible, though. It's possible that maybe the spray makes it so they can shoot worse. Because it took the same amount of time. I think I'll stick with the minigun on the last guy, though. If for nothing else, it seems to explode the helicopter rather than just killing the pilot. So, and now we have the hardest part. The part that is normally the RNG part. Oh great. It's amazing. Sweet. Cool. That's perfect. It's just amazing first first shots RNG in boats. That's great. It's lovely RNG. Thank you, Rockstar. Love you. But just because they're moving boats doesn't mean they shouldn't have perfect accuracy from a billion miles away. What are you talking about, man? Everyone loves when enemies have perfect accuracy in situations where they can't possibly have perfect accuracy. That's great, man. Find the person who programmed this game 
or this mission and kick them right in the balls. I died six times there, didn't I? Six times. Wow. Technically, I can still PB. So he still- there's Fisher people, what the fuck? I still have to continue. I could indeed say this run got derailed, yes. Monkey business is only really difficult at the end here. Especially because you can just sit here and let these first guards walk, walk by. Clear. How did that miss? What? So, grenade launcher basically? Well, that fire is not in a good location. I think I'm going to wait this one out, guys. Easy. It's a lot easier than the pacifist run, that's all I gotta say. Oh, okay. Probably should have let Dave do that one. And you know how the game kind of cheats sometimes. Like, considering Dave can kill these guys, there's no real reason that I should take the risk. Oh, shit, he's dead. Uh, he is dead. That's definitely gonna kill all the fires starting. I was gonna throw it with my weapon. But I failed. The explosion of these mines is actually smaller than you might think. We might be okay, but I doubt it. Okay, we're fine. Cool. Now for this last asshole. Kill him, Dave! I believe in you. Okay. This kills a bunch of guys that... I think it kills like three or four guys. It makes it so Steve is less likely to die. Let's see if I can kill anyone who pops up here. So Steve's mo uh, Dave's moving up, so that's good, so Steve won't die. Like, I've been shot all the way back here before. I've been shot through these boxes and stuff as well. I don't really want to move forward at all. Like, I could totally get this guy through. Risky shot. Bit of works. You can't argue with success. So again, we're on Bury the Hatches. Let's hope my levitation doesn't screw up. Oh my god, am I... You remember I died in the levitation before, and then... Oh, come on! I am fairly certain the reason why I died is because I hit the top of the invisible barrier before falling down. I don't know if I want to intentionally stand on it and then stand on the hedge, or if I just want to go balls deep over it. Because the way that fall damage is calculated should mean that as long as I don't hit anything on the way down, that I should be fine. But fall damage in this game is weird, you know? I would rather just not fall. So I do have the suppressor. I bought it earlier. What? Uh, see, he's not meant to be there. Is that because I skipped through? I'm so happy I didn't die there. I do not... It's very rare to see him like that. Already standing there. Is it... Based on where I climb over? The wall, the being... I don't know what the fuck that was. Okay. I'm happy his bullets don't alert them, or I would be majorly screwed. Um, okay. Let us hope for the best, chat. So I'm gonna do the aim, aiming down the sight tapping thing. 
I think I'm gonna fall and die. Just knowing my luck in this run, you know. How long is this taking, dude? Does it normally take this long? I think it does. I just haven't done it in a while. I need to get all the way up to here on the- see- see the camera at the top? Getting to the top of this, um... Tombstone. My hands are sweating! See, that's the strat I'm doing. I'm landing on top of the invisible wall and then going down. Rather than trying to fall over it. I think both would work. <sighs> easy game, easy life. Okay, that was not easy. That was just nerve-wracking beyond reason. <laughs> Realistically, here on Pac-Man, since I have a chance of being shot by these police, I should really become Franklin ASAP, like as soon as possible. I should maybe even take the actual route you're meant to take, because the one thing I don't want to happen is the police catching up and getting in front of me here. Oh crap, I'm dead. 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 Oh my god, I didn't die. He actually shot at me though. See that? You do not want any of these guys getting in front of you. Has it happened once or twice that I've been hit? And I can't even look behind me because it influences their spawns. Oh, he's gonna get in front of me too. Is he alive? He's alive. I also can't go in front of the truck or it influences their spawns. Like I have to be here. Okay. I don't know where that shot went, but that was scary. They do bring up their guns, so you may notice that they bring up their guns um, when they get shot, by, they're hit by the spikes and they spin around, but they don't shoot. You always want to get them with the spikes. Like, it's not a high chance that you die there, but I mean, the existent chance is always concerning. For those new to the run, this is fresh meat, and I'm about to do something to skip a bunch of enemies to get to Michael. So we trigger this. Let us hope that none of those enemies come down here and I don't fail this for 20 minutes. Being there, don't enjoy it. Worse, let's hope I don't kill myself. I always imagined one day that for the speed run I'd be practicing this skip so I'd get it first every time. But there's no reason to do that anymore because the speed run has a much better strat here but it can only be done 1.27. There you go. I think, I think it might actually matter doing it as fast as possible, honestly. Setting all the mines. I have all the time in the world. Um, I can only, I can only set 15 mines there, right? So let's not go too crazy. I can have a maximum of 20 mines in single player, but if I want to put down the five proximity mines, I can only use 15 C4. What was that weird flicker in the screen, though? Got him. Perfect. Are you still shot? See it shot? That guy dies by himself. There's another one? Shit. Got his foot, though. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. He almost killed me. I can't. I can't believe he didn't die. So these guys already died to proximity mines? How he that does do fall damage. I'm gonna give them time to spawn in, but not time enough for Michael to come. It is possible in previous attempts, the last guys haven't died because either I've thrown too many mines and despawned my first mines or I didn't give them time to spawn in. 
In this case, it seems I managed to get them all, which is good. Come on, come on, let's go. This is my rescue mission, dog. This guy can come out to me. I just want to get home. I'm going to get you here. There were still the guys from the very beginning of the game that I skipped all over there, and I'm always concerned they're going to run at me. Oh, he got in the back seat. That is, uh, rare. That was textbook, though. That went really well. So if you recall, I actually died here. What?! I drove past some cops and they killed me. So we're gonna avoid cops as much as possible. Uh-oh. Well, I really didn't want to have my door be obscure. How- how- I disagree. Now I don't have a black arrow. Uh, I'm gonna have to go some weird way out of here. This is not good. Because a helicopter can fire at me. This is the opposite of good. I'm just gonna risk it. I hear gunfire. There's a cop there. It, okay. That was not how I wanted that to go down. How did I just regain the cops there? That made no fucking sense. Oh wait, that's a police station. Probably shouldn't drive near that. That's, uh, that's probably not a great move. Open. Okay, that, I don't know why it didn't open, but okay. Whatever you reckon, game. Be a dick. See if I care. So, we didn't die, but I mean, that rarely happens on this mission, so it's not particularly surprising. Fucking fire crew, dude. I hate getting this bloody fire truck. Thank you. Thank you, kind sir. Is this fire truck gonna leave? See if it despawns. I'll try and chase it. Uh, I think it's despawned. Uh. Thank you. The fire department. The fire department will drive directly past you and ignore you completely. No, 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 no. And there's a cop here. That's amazing. I'm gonna get shot. I actually got shot. By what? What killed me? What killed me? What killed me? What killed me? Well, PB's dead. But but one cop was hit by the water and had a shotgun and didn't fire it. The other cop was halfway getting out of the car, so could not shoot. I want to see this, actually. I'm assuming he somehow did not get hit by the water and just... Kill me there? That's such amazingly terrible RNG, dude. They're coming for me. There's no way they're gonna get here before the star ends, right? Are you serious? Ah, uh, he would have just barely seen me. Good thing I moved. What do you mean this vehicle is unsuitable for a getaway car? It is the gold standard of getaway cars. This vehicle can be used as a getaway vehicle. I hate you. The setting up of getaway cars in this game is programmed so terribly. It might be the worst program thing in the game. Clearly, considering I just did the setup, I should probably do... <laughs> I should really do... The fire truck mission first, but, uh... You know what I want to do, Ashley? You know what I want to do? How much money does Michael have? A million dollars. Can I buy... What's the car called? Like, a Zenturo? While this isn't bulletproof, it has the most closed back. Make it pink? Nah, I'm Batman. Okay. To the airport. I hate these doors so much. You have no idea. 
I might be going a bit too fast here because I am going so fast, more fast than normal. He did. So he decided it is still best for me to ult strat this. Well, 99% of the time, uh, I can get through here without this guy on the right shooting me. It just doesn't seem worth it. Look at Molly being disintegrated in slow-mo. Don't die, please. Okay, so there's a helicopter who always spawns and I'm always concerned he's gonna shoot me. Oh shit. Okay. So I took a different route there, being concerned about being shot by a security guard in a different location. And I still got shot at by someone else anyway, so. I did actually take the shots on the back of the car there, so who knows, maybe I did actually just save my life having this car, who knows, you know? And plus, I can get here really fast, so I, yeah, maybe I'll keep doing this. It was suggested by a handful of people over the time I've been doing the mission, but it just seemed like such a huge pain in the ass. I look like that idiot Darkfire from YouTube. Entirely coincidental. Me and that guy share nothing in common. That guy's a communist, anarchist, scumbag, Marxist, Leninist. Um, vegan. Fuck that guy. <laughs> Even worse, I heard he was a speedrunner. Exactly, what a fucking tool. Leninist vegans are called lentilists. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever eaten lentils. What, stand back from the- okay, whatever. He did. I mean, he could have been knocked out, you didn't really check. So, gonna ult strat through this because I can't see shit as per usual. Why did the door explode? I guess pressure from the other side, I don't know. Ah, I think it exploded, it's like a influx of air causing fire to flame out. I'm, I, I'm not a fireologist. This guy's right in the door. You watch him melee and kill me. Are you watching? He didn't do it because you weren't watching. <laughs> that guy's mailing. Oh my god, no! Okay. See, he only did that because you're watching. Just stop watching my stream. Go away! <laughs> you can't tell me what to do, streamer. I'll watch all day and night if I have to. You are so funny that you laugh at your own jokes. I'm on the record, and I've said it many times. I think I'm hilarious. I have composed tweets that have received barely any likes, that have had me in stitches for like five minutes. I have sat there just chuckling to myself like a fool in this sm small closed space in this house all by myself because I've made some shitty joke on Twitter. I don't care how lame it is. It makes my life far more enjoyable. Thought he was meleeing for a second there. I can't see the stairs. Or the railing, so it makes it hard to run down. Okay. We are indeed outs, Franklin. You have correctly identified the place in which we find ourselves, which is outs. Why would you say something so controversial, yet so brave? Um, I... One, I forgot to go get weapons and stuff. For all the characters. Two, I forgot to save and reload, which is something that I need to do so that I can use alt strat at the beginning of the mission. Do I have an auto save? I do. Yeah. So because I saved and reloaded, I should be able to use alt strat here immediately. Uh, see? Maybe that's why we're such great friends, huh? We're old school, like old fashioned things. Newspapers, celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. I hear gunfire. I do not like this. Okay, last bit. 
So small risk of death that this guy shoots me and then small risk of death that Trevor gets shot immediately. I've never seen him get shot immediately. But I have seen bullets fly up to him before I can crouch. It swaps your weapon here. Watch it swap. See? It stops me sometimes too. That's why it's very awkward. Oh. Now, i got to focus on me moving Michael. Killing everyone else doesn't really matter. Except these guys. I'm surprised I got that many. I think everyone else respawns. Those guys matter because they're just close to me. Ah, and the helicopter's true. I've never left them long enough to know whether the helicopters will target me. I don't really want to find out. This was a lot harder when I first made these strats because I would legitimately be killing everyone so I'd run out of shots. <sighs> it's a little bit close to Michael there. Just trying. Uh, did I just block Michael? Uh oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> I thought I screwed myself a second there. So now I should be able to kill everyone. Oops. I should have killed these guys first. That's not good. Okay. Oh. When did he spawn? No! Oh, Jesus. I need to kill both of these at the same time. Okay, good. So everyone here should be dead. Okay. So the strat I'm doing here is intentionally killing Dave as he f goes by. This will make it so the helicopter will already be spawned when I respawn. It does mean that I spawn in the down there area, which may mean I, I will die, but alt strat should save me. Last time I tried to do this, I legit missed Dave. Ah! He drives in such a weird pattern, man, like... Why not using C4? That would be a, an amazing idea. I don't even have a minigun. I don't know what I want to do now. What I'm going to do is the outrunning strat. And hope the helicopter kills itself. As long as the yellow dot stays, I'm fine. Another chopper. Ah, oh, God, it didn't stay. That is... Oh, it did. Okay, good. Okay. Maybe this is the strat I should go with every time, but if the helicopter lives for whatever reason, I get really screwed. That's... Uh, that may still even... Actually, thinking about that may still even be more secure than the strat that I wanted to do. Maybe I will do that more in the future. So now I have to get my tank and hope Trevor doesn't kill me. What an asshole. What a twit. Oh, yeah, well, twit is also a thing that he was. Just save in case something goes wrong with the tank. Can't you order a tank on the internet for $3 million? Do you have $3 million? If so, why are you not donating to my stream? What a joke. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm like one or two episodes behind on the boys. Okay, let's see where Trevor is. Oh, there he is. I swear he wasn't there before. No, go away. 
I suppose the most secure thing to do is to kill Trevor. Except for the fire. He can't kill me when he's dead. Ha <laughs> Pay my hospital charges. It's not my fault you didn't use your invulnerability, Trevor. Though technically you can't with this mod. Okay, just one more long drive to go. God damn it, game. That's why you're safe. Everything else is kind of... I'm only kind of doing it sometimes. What? What? Hello? May I'm too close to the house? Let the door close. Open it. Move off. Basically even save the game. Again. Then move in. There we go. Not sure what that was. Who cares? Can you shoot in the opposite direction to go faster? It would damage my tank. This isn't uh, San Andreas. Kinda wanted to get up there, game. Not gonna lie. Okay, so I'm gonna activate the mission without activating the yellow dot. I've never done it from here before. Usually I do it from up there. I hope there's no difference. More guys spawn here. Coming down from here, I think. Normally, I don't have to kill those guys. There's a guy up here somewhere? Oh, he's over there. My main goal is to not hit myself. He just fell down there, did he? Oh, shit. Oh, come on! Trevor isn't even here yet. Hope that's not significant for some reason. Normally I let Trevor kill the last person here. Come on. Okay. So there's one guy with Lamar. It's better to let Trevor kill him. So I have to wait for Trevor to kill this guy? I heard an oof. He is oofing. Some nice cover you got there, friendo. Hooray. Feels like I'm in pacifist percent again. Remember that time I went up these poles and killed myself? I'm not doing that this time. I'm just gonna go up this way. Hey, Lamar, it's me. We up so trigger Lamar. Got to go down off the right here, because I need to get onto the wood chips. If I don't, then I splat. So graceful. So majestic. Let's hope no guns clip into the tank this time. Yeah, I'm gonna try and drive myself somewhere safer. Oh. But as I was about to say, it's hard to get out of here smoothly. Um... So, like, we'll move up here. Keeping my cockpit the furthest away from people possible. I need to stop these guys from getting to Michael. Ah! Michael's gonna die. I'm gonna lose. I'm dead. I'm dead. Forgot about this. I thought they were... Okay. My tank is almost on fire. I'll be the first to admit this has not gone the way that I intended it to go. Ah! Oh god.
Uh, there are exactly two guys left. Can I trust Trevor to kill these two? If I can, I can wait for him. Or if not, I can go to the yellow dot. Since I can't switch characters, I know I've killed enough to progress. Oh, these are the, some of the lights you can break with your face. Nice. Can't believe Trevor can't kill one guy. Where is he? It must be the very first guy. There's two guys who spawned at the beginning. There he is. Everything there was terrible. Everything. And now we have Meltdown. Oh boy, the most stressful mission in this bloody game. It's not actually, it's probably top five though. All right, Jimmy, you keep yourself concealed. So we just want one on the stairs. Did, I, did that miss? Oh, it did. <laughs> I meant to kill a man there, okay? That was part of the plan. Okay, wait for that fire to go out. That guy would sometimes immediately kill me by having the mine there near the bottom of the stairs. He has effectively no time. So it's true, sw switch to a different weapon. I never want to risk it for this guy here. Not yet. Stay put. Give me some cover. The fire there makes it so I can't really. Neither do I. Just keep calm. I usually put mines outside. That was a terrible spot to put a mine if this guy doesn't come to me. Please come inside. Good. Good. Uh, another guy spawned outside. That's interesting. Kill, kill, kill. Get down. Probably left that a little bit long. The fire is a part of what concerns me and its ability to spread. I don't normally wait to put these mines out here this long. I hope I'm not going to cause things to spawn where I don't want them to. Drop it, prick. Oh, it's fire. Random fire. Okay. What the fuck is this? Come inside. Oh, he's not coming that way. Can I make it? Get out of here. What a Thought I missed for a second though. Fire! Um, so I think that was the singular guy being taken out by my mind, which is not what I want. Get down. So now I've got this whole group of guys who are going to come in. I hope that got the other car. This is not looking good for me. Hit the floor. You dirtbag. Should put down the stairs. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, I didn't get the other car. I'm dead. Shoot. Drop this would be a clusterfuck. The fire will block him, which is actually bad for me. Okay, well, unless he actually ca catches on fire, that's good for me. Okay, well, <laughs> okay, that works too. Fair enough. I thought the fire would have held him off, 
So he wasn't gonna, um, he, he would, he would stay there and shoot me as I came out. But he could also just walk onto the fire and die. Well, time to do the big score and see if I can at least time my PB. It's always kind of scary, this mission, but the strats are pretty good. And I've just realized that I forgot to buy additional gear. So we are now going to go and op open the autosave and go buy some gear. Already fucking up. So it's just Trevor who needs gear, right? Yes, just Trevor, yeah. <sighs> okay, so the biggest threat to my existence at the in, in this section here is just Trevor immediately getting shot in the hand. Oh wait, shit. Wrong spot. Stood in the wrong spot. But now I'm fucked. Now I'm fucked. How did I miss that guy? I was uh, surprised he jumped out. I need to kill someone or Michael's gonna die. Please stand up. Thank you. There's a guy right there. The snipers didn't tell me they were there. Are they there? Oh shit, they're not. Huh, weird. You learn more about the fail conditions here when we get to pacifist, but um, just learn, just, just know it, as, as a general rule, the fail conditions here make absolutely no sense, and whoever made this mission is brain dead. Yeah, so I got shot immediately. Okay, cool. Then I, I did nothing wrong here. No, I did tons of things wrong, but it's okay. These guys, ne this, this this singular sofa makes it so much harder than it has to be. The thing that I fucked up was just this first shot here. Where's it end up over here? Because I missed that first shot, I deserved everything that came to me there in terms of failing. 100% my fault. Uh, so one guy lived there. Oh, they still spawn, that's good. And now the rest of this is a cakewalk. Legit, just missing that first thing was what caused all my problems. There's a guy really close to me here. Oh, there he is. Oh, you can shoot me, actually. That's fine. Yeah, it's unfortunate, but what are you gonna do? You know? I made a mistake, and I deserve to die. Those shots there, dude. I don't know if they've, if they've ever hit me, but... Oh, shit. Never look behind you during that section, Matt. You know that. Now I can die here because he's going to get fired me. Okay. Now I'm way behind and can't shoot this helicopter early. I if I can shoot it down here. Never tried. That doesn't seem so. So taxiing here can kill me. It doesn't matter at this point, does it? I'm gonna try taxiing here and see what it does. Okay, buddy. There you go. It's a better spot. So kill Trevor? Yeah, we kill Trevor. Best ending, yeah. Trevor, die. 
Look at Trevor burn like my run. Sub 11 though, not that it matters. Well, at least we learned some things, chat. Disappointing end, but what can you do? Let us say, hypothetically, there's a large number of mercenary boats. Let's say a fleet, okay? And now, technically, if you see them, they will be here. Am I wrong? Okay, now, for the sake of argument, let's say also that you're with a friend, a bro. Now, if maybe the fleet is here, bro, then naturally that will result in a wet-ass P-word. <laughs> be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel. It costs you nothing, and I wish you all the best.